My name is Bill Detheridge, and I practice law in Hopkinsville, Kentucky. I've uh, been a lawyer for a little over 36 years, I do some criminal defense law, and I oppose the death penalty for several reasons. Uh, one is just basic moral grounds. I, I believe it's uh, inhumane and uncivilized for uh, a society that claims to be civilized to be in the business of killing people. Also, having worked in the legal system for uh, as long as I have, I realize that it's, it's a very imperfect system and it does make mistakes. There are errors that are going to occur because human beings make decisions. And uh, if we execute an innocent person, uh, that cannot be corrected. However, if we convict a person wrongfully and that person is incarcerated, well then up until the point that that person may die while in prison, that mistake can be corrected at least to some degree. And because of the uh, imperfections, the, the tendency for error that's just necessarily built into our system, uh, it, it seems to me that it's just incomprehensible that we would execute people based on decisions that come out of that, that system. And I, I think uh, our history is showing us uh, that there have been a lot of mistakes and that there have been innocent people executed. Uh, recently, uh, within the last few days, I just read an account of a, of a fellow from Texas who was convicted, I think, back in 1992, was wrong, was executed in 2004, and it was later deter determined that uh, he was convicted in error, but because he was executed, that error is now permanent and, and it cannot be changed, much to his detriment and that of his family. So those are the primary reasons why I oppose the death penalty.